Hey guys, Jimmy Vegas here, and today we're taking a look at an asset in the Unity Asset Store simply called Skeleton King. Now, I initially came to this one when I was looking for some assets to use uh, for my RPG series, and I decided I'd actually take a look at this one and see what it was like. So, quality wise, it's not too bad. It looks visually fairly nice. You know, it's not drastically awful, it's not fantastically brilliant, but it's not too bad. It does come with a demo scene, which is always nice to see. Uh, quantity, you just get this guy. That's all there really is to it, but you wouldn't expect any more anyway. So when we say extras, there isn't anything in the way of extras, really. Uh, we get uh, in the shader folder for the lightweight render pipeline. We get, well, you can use that if you want to use it. It's, you know, it's entirely up to you. But I'm only taking a look at the actual model itself here. So what do we get? Well, we get the materials, we get the model, we get the prefab, and we get the textures. One thing to note here, when I imported this into uh, Unity and opened up this demo scene, you'll see here, this is what it actually looked like. All you would need to do is just change your material to basically be uh, a standard one. So it comes as one that may not be uh, there for you, but it doesn't really matter too much. If you just change it to standard or whatever uh, shader you want, this is it right there. Anyway. The problem with this is it comes with animations, but it comes all as one animation, which is, in all fairness, useless. Um, it's not a completely useless asset, but the animation it does come with is useless. If I press play now and show you what I mean. So yes, he's animating now, he's in the idle pose. However, when he moves on to his next animation, it is the same animation. There is only one animation this entire uh, file which is a little bit annoying to be honest and personally I find it a little bit useless for what people would want to use it for but you may not so on that premise I think this may be better uh, in the realms of it's something as a background thing so if I turn the animator off he looks like that he just looks like a menacing kind of creature so for a backdrop it might do okay as a background figure it might be okay uh, obviously, when it comes to modifying how it looks, we can always play around with the material if we want to, you know, make it really creepy and, you know, well, there you go. That's kind of cool right there. So customizable. Yeah, of course it is. Most assets are. You can pretty much do anything you want with it. You could even attach a random normal map on there to make it a bit bumpy if you wanted to. But again, that's down to how you want to develop your own game. Uh, I kind of like that, actually. It's quite nice. Uh, so yeah, customizable. Yeah, of course it is. Uh, the size of the asset is 2.6 meg, which is really nice to see. It is a really uh, small file size. So if you're on a meter connection, slow connection, that's really, really good. That's what I like to see. It is, of course, free at the time of recording this uh, review. However, asset prices do change from time to time. Just keep that in mind. So as you guys know, I don't rate assets, I either recommend them or I don't. And I'm afraid I don't think I would recommend this asset. Uh, reason being is it's kind of useless in the way it is, unless you're prepared to put the extra work in to make it useful. However, I would recommend it to a degree if you were to have this as like a background uh, model or as an image for something, you could capture that as an image and place it somewhere if you wanted to. So no, I wouldn't recommend it for most, almost all purposes, but I would for some slight purposes like I've just mentioned. Don't forget guys, click on the subscribe button and click the bell icon as well. Stay up to date with reviews, tutorials, Unity games, everything on game development. Uh, let me know what you think of this asset if you've used it yourself. Uh, what could be done to make it better? What do you think? What are your thoughts? If you've got anything on the asset store as well, please let me know in the comments. I would love to take a look and possibly review one of these videos. Guys, thank you very much for watching.